Hey folks, George the DJ here. Today I want to do a quick product review on the Denon Audio Commander. Now this is a very powerful 200 watt RMS speaker. The one inch tweeter inside of a wood cabin with a porthole and a 12 inch woofer. And again that's 200 watts RMS, not peak. It has multiple channels that you can connect through and ways to connect. Two built-in wireless microphones. Battery power will last you three hours at full power, eight hours at half power. I used it this weekend for a wedding and was able to get, I don't know, I got to five hours and I still had two bars. So I know you can get five or six hours if you use it three quarters of the way. Multiple inputs on the back. As you can see by number one is an eighth inch, number two RCA. You have a USB and an SD card. And then you have the XLR combo uh, quarter inch design for line one and line two. And the option to make that a mic input or just a regular line. We actually ran a guitar through here as well last weekend at the wedding. You also have a line out. And of course, because this thing weighs uh, 47, 48 pounds, you do have a luggage style handle that you can use to carry this with, and you'll be glad you did. The speaker has a speaker pole insert hole, and as you see, you can place it on a speaker stand. If you're facing the front, there's a little storage area over here to the side. I just keep a cord in there. But over here to the right side, you can tell there's room for your wireless mics in there. Now again, it comes with one wireless mic that's a handheld. So I've heard there are issues with the mic, but it uh, seems to be working fine for me, a uh, good distance. I did have it give me difficulty last week. Went to a higher channel, channel 11, seemed to fix the problem. I'm not sure if that's what it was, but testing out here at the house, no issues. And this would be on line one on the back. I've got mine on channel 11. Line two, you see channel seven, and that's for your lavalier mic, the one that you uh, can wear over your ear, hands free. There are uh, 16 channels available for both mics. So one area opportunity is better directions on the browse knob for the audio commander. Um, you can see I have auxiliary one listed here, but if I wanted to use auxiliary two It won't cut on unless it's on this front panel Now what I can do is I can turn until I see auxiliary two come up Here it goes again press the browse knob and now it's locked on as an option Let's say I wanted to come down here and cut on mic two, which was my uh, lavalier mic or that hands-free mic and cut that on Let's say I want to come up here and now I don't need auxiliary one. I would need to press the back button to remove it from here. So it took me a little while to figure that out. The sound on this thing is pretty amazing. My overall rating for the speaker would be somewhere between a four and a five. Yes. The sound of the speaker is incredible. Check this out. <laughs> So all of that was from outside at a wedding I did this weekend. You saw guitars being played through it, me playing ceremony music. I was just using a little music stand with an iPad. Uh, had a lot of fun. Um, at the rehearsal dinner, they asked me. Put one 
the speaker in the corner for this and it was able to jam up the stage and really good sound, good lows and all the bridesmaids and the little kids you see out there had a lot of fun. I wasn't even turned up halfway. This thing is loud and it's very clean. Um, I think it can compete in the upper end category. You're talking price wise $6.99, but some of the upper end speakers are, I guess what, $8.99 for the Maui Go and $14, almost $1,500, I think, for the JBL uh, Eon One Pro. Again, really good speakers. They uh, haven't heard the Maui Go. I've heard the regular Maui. I wasn't a fan. JBL sounded really good, but when I looked at ratings for that, just to my ear, this has a lot more power. This thing gets incredibly loud. Now again, it's very heavy, but the wheels make up for that. You don't have to use it on the stand, but if you're doing a big audience, you're gonna want it on the stand. So I definitely would suggest considering this uh, as a go-to for your wireless gigs, for your ceremony gigs, roll it all in in one place, again, Maybe work on the browse button directions, Denon, and I'm not sure if the, maybe I'll just keep checking out the uh, mic myself and report back if I have any other issues. Uh, but I definitely would recommend this. I'm Georgia DJ, and as always, thanks for watching.